Okay, let's give you guys some more practice. So determine if this series will converge or if it will diverge. So press pause and have a go. Okay, so to do this, um, in order for any series to converge, the limit must must equal zero as n tends to infinity. The limit of this must equal zero in order for any series to converge. So the first thing we should do is to, to make sure that the limit of this equals zero. So e e equals zero. So uh, so the first thing we should do is to check it. So so as n tends to infinity, you've got one block multiplying another block. This block here is going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. This block here, um, well, n gets very, very big. So this thing here is going to be head towards zero, sine of zero. Um, uh, head, well, this block here is heading towards zero. This, he this is heading towards infinity, which is an indeterminate form. So, so, uh, so we would use the trick that we've always used in the past, which was to, um, to rewrite this, rewrite this whole thing here as one block divided by one over n. So, so this is exactly the same as this, but just written differently. So, uh, so now let's check it as n tends to infinity, uh, n tends to infinity, this whole block here will head towards zero, uh, n tends to infinity, this block here will head towards zero, zero over zero is an, in, is an indeterminate form, so you can apply L'Hopital's rule. So applying L'Hopital's rule means you can differentiate the top, that will then give you this, and then differentiate the bottom, that will then give you this, uh, and then, well these two, they cancel each other out. So, uh, so leaving you with cos 1 over n. So as n tends to infinity, um, uh, as n tends to infinity, this will head towards 0, cos of 0 will be 1. So the limit of this thing is 1. So in order for any series to converge, the limit must equal 0. But here, the limit equals 1. So, uh, so we, we can conclude that this thing here is, is going to, uh, to diverge. If you get a graph plotter and plot this, it will look like this. So, so what that means is, as as you as n tends to infinity, what what's hap what's happening is that you 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 are adding near near enough one, and then you add it, and then you incre increase it. Then you're adding near enough another another one, and then you're adding something near another one. It's it's not it's, so you add you you you're because it's because this thing here doesn't converge to zero. This thing here, you you you're always going to add. Uh, something near near one, you, you're going to add something else to it. You're going to add another piece. You're going to add another piece. It's never going to converge uh, b because the limit of this is 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 one. Um, it's like you you're adding one each time. You're adding one and then you're adding another one and then you're adding another one and then you're adding another one. It's just going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. In order for for this, in order for any series to converge, the the it has to head towards zero. the limit must be zero in order for it to converge. But here the limit is one, so you're you're in effect adding one to it each time. It's never going to converge. It's going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. So we can conclude that the uh, the series here will diverge. Okay.